Hey y'all, welcome to my YouTube channel. Um, I'm sorry if you need to hear the heat, but it is started snowing today. Like, that's a little weird because it's, it's March and I don't think I've ever really seen it snow in in March. I don't know, but anywho. Um, um, <laughs> yeah, so today I'm not going to be doing like too much talking in this video only because um, I just don't want to, so we just gonna hop right into it. So, let's get it. <laughs> Alright, I'm sorry. I said I really want to talk too much, but it's just like I hate how things are like this going right now, and I feel like nothing is like really working for me right now. Nothing, like. It's, it has nothing to do with like a man or anything it, it's just life and it, it's just like when it's life is different totally different from a man or whatever it's like when you trying like you really really trying to get your ish together and all that but then life is like keep keep fucking with you keep keep knocking you down and it's just it's irritating it's so irritating and i think the only difference is now I'm taking it like a little bit more better like back then I probably would have just shut down and I would have thought of like everything that I already went through and been like oh it only it's only happening because of, of me like who I am like you know like the universe is just out to get me not realizing that everybody's going through shit but yeah I'm just taking life better but at the same time I have cried about it and like with certain things um i have talked about it and i swear i hate when people be like um you just gotta have this i don't care attitude and just move on from it like no me i'm a talker i'm gonna talk it out i'm gonna say what i gotta say and i feel like my family knows that about me like i'm gonna say it y'all can sit around and i say it but i'm gonna say it so yeah but yeah that's just not me i'm not the person that they will just hold it in unless unless like i feel like i need to but if it's really bothering me then i'm going to speak on it regardless of what you say regardless of like people saying like you're giving that person power or you're giving it power but i don't care i'm going to talk about it but i just realized like <clears throat> i just realized that you know i'm just i'm just taking it better than before like i'm, I'm really mature but it just sucks like when you're really trying to do stuff out here and it's just like you get in no 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 like back to back and back to back like it hurts so much but eventually you know it's, it's gonna work out it's it has to like there's no doubt in my mind that i will stay in this position so like i'm just i just never thought like that like it's always going to be bad anyway but like i'm going to keep trying like i'm i'm not going to quit so yeah but yeah um i'm just going to finish off my eyebrows and then i'll be back so yeah y'all <laughs> welcome to my set talk <laughs> if my um if my camera and stuff look weird today well, in this video, if it looks weird, it's only because I'm not using my camera. I'm using my iPad because my camera um, is full. So, yeah, I've been doing, like, a lot of videos for y'all. And just, like, I mean, for myself, too, <laughs> because I love creating videos. So, yeah, um, I'm going to be having, like, a lot of videos coming back to back for y'all. But, yeah, <clears throat> that's the only thing. And... If it's not zoomed in all the way, my bad. My camera usually like zooms in, but I'm using my iPad, so can't do that. And then on top of that, um, I know I'm like ranting, but um, I washed my um uh, my braids. That's why they look a little fuzzy, and that's like new growth. But last time I had my um, last time I had these, I I didn't wash them because I thought my hair will lock but it don't so i'm kind of mad that i took them out before but 
yeah i feel like i'm gonna do this more because i love um not loose box braids so yeah um but anyway i'm gonna go ahead and finish my eyebrows and then i'll be back all right y'all so i just finished my eyebrows it took me a little second because i wasn't paying attention and yeah but usually when i do my eyebrows um i just realized i never knew like that tight feeling that i get in my chest that's from anxiety and i didn't know that until somebody else said it and i was like oh my god it's just whole time that's been a that's been anxiety that i've been dealing with and i've been dealing with it since i was like in freaking middle school and i was like yeah that it was from middle school because i remember the situation happened to where like um my phone like notified me or something and the only person that ever really notified me was what like the little games i used to play and my mom so that was it i didn't really have nobody in my phone anyway <laughs> but this administrator he um he he said something about it and he just made this big thing and I, he told me to turn my phone off so i did but he thought i was just sitting on my phone like when he told me to turn it off but i wasn't and he just did this like big made this big situation and i remember like i was in the bathroom and i couldn't breathe and i was crying because like i was actually a good student like i was not like a bad student but i had those moments to where like i would go off on you because at that time like people used to like bully me so i started sticking up for myself so yeah but i was i was still a good student either way and um yeah i just rem i just remember that and now like thinking back going through a high school I went. I already knew I had went through depression um, throughout high school. I picked up on that, but I'm just now realizing like I I had this like anxiety problem before the depression. So I was like, wow. But um, depression, yeah, um, yeah, that just that just kind of happened. I wish somebody like actually picked up on me going through that because i didn't know like what i was going through at that time until after i got out of high school and yeah i was just i was really just going through a lot like a lot a lot yeah. <laughs> but yeah like if my kids ever tell me like they want to be homeschooled i will allow them to be homeschooled because i remember telling that to my mom but she thought like i just didn't want to go to school which wasn't the case I really just didn't like being in school. I didn't like being around people. So always like try to listen to your kids or something when they like trying to tell you something. Not saying that my mom didn't listen to me, but I wish like I should have, I feel like I should have spoke up more or I should have like had therapy or something because my depression, like it really, 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 really hit me. And I didn't even know, like, before depression became, like, this big wave and everybody was just on it, I didn't know what I was going through. So, yeah. Like, I wish I would have had that. I'm sorry, y'all. I know I said I wasn't going to talk, but I'm talking. <laughs> but I'm going to stop talking and I'm actually just going to watch it. If I have anything else to say, then I'll just be back. So yeah, I'm just gonna let y'all watch and I'm gonna, yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, and if y'all wanna know what palette I'm using, I'm using the Alexis Stone Instinct palette and I'm using the hot pink and then all the way up. So yeah, I'm just gonna use those three colors, not like that purple color at the bottom. So that's what I'm using. But um, when I was saying like how people be like, oh, um, like you gotta have like this, I don't give a fuck ass attitude like all the time. Yeah, that is me sometimes, but it's not me all the time. And I just feel like people, they just, they just stir that out like too much. Like y'all know how Kat was in Euphoria when she was like, I don't love myself right now. I kind of hate myself right now. 
and I feel like sometimes that is that's true though like I don't feel my best every single day every single day and that's okay there's nothing wrong with that that is literally okay but but like yeah the self-love part but when it comes to like the emotional part with this world I feel like everybody's just like you gotta you gotta be like this I don't care type of person and just like no you you really don't if you are open be open if you want to tell somebody how you feel tell them how they feel I'm not sitting here saying you know chase after them don't chase nobody that don't want you don't let nobody sh like show you a million times that they don't want you but if you have something to say say it I mean that's what I do because like you you came into my space you know you came over here so of course i'm gonna have something to say you're a person you're a freaking human and i feel like people just kind of blow me when they be like no nah, i'm not gonna say nothing i'm not gonna show you how i truly feel you know why because that's some simp shit yes i'm cursing but they're gonna be like yeah that's that's some simp stuff and somebody actually told me that like but no that's not true like somebody that really wants you and really wants to be a part of you they're going to show you their true feelings they're going to open up to you so oh, yeah but people are just stupid like don't listen to people um like i said it's okay for you to um like not care all the time like sometimes just shut up <laughs> especially people that you don't know like like if i don't know somebody or like somebody just say something like really stupid to me i'm like shut up okay shut up don't don't okay so i would just like not care that way and i'm not saying that, like i speak up all the time because i don't but i will say something like i'm not just about to let you do your wrong and not point it out to you um and people be like well sometimes you just gotta shut up that is true sometimes you do just gotta shut up but when it's time to speak up speak up speak up and i don't i don't bottle stuff in and like i'll send somebody a text message and then i'll block them because i already made my mind up what i want to do with you so i'll send that message and i don't care for your response so i would just i would just block you that's it <laughs> And people be like, so you don't you don't wait for the response? No. No, I'm not gonna wait for the response. Not at all. And I do that because I'm thinking about all this stuff and I did right by you, but you did your wrong to me and it's just like why am I sad? Why am I, why do I have to go through all this when I you know? <laughs> like you know. <laughs> But yeah, it's just like, it just kind of sucks. So hell yeah, I'm gonna write that, write that paragraph. Hell yeah, I'm gonna type it out and I'm gonna spill all my feelings because I opened up to you. You know, at some point I opened up to you. So why not, why not say how I feel? And I feel like it's just so stupid how people just like, show him don't care, show him that, just show him, show him, show him. Shut up, shut the hell up. And do what you think is best for you which trust me people be saying they be doing all these things half the time they don't do all these things people say one thing one minute and I, I kid you not they would do one thing the next well another thing the next so do not be trying to ride somebody else's wave thinking that's gonna get them far because half the time hell no they be in the same exact spot and they don't even be listening to their own advice just do you why did I take the eyeshadow up that far? I didn't mean to do that. And yes, this is like an all pink look. So I'm going to be using the Winter Rose base from P. Louise. And I'm just going to have like a wing cut crease. So the vibe is pink. Pink Panther. Mm. And, and yes, we're doing rhinestones. So we're going all out. Alright y'all, so I'm finally finished cutting the cut crease. Um, so now I'm just going to take some shadow and go over top 
um like i said i am using the alexis on instinct palette um i've been using this palette the whole time like i don't think i switched out at all it's the first well not the first but you know what i'm saying like i use a lot of palettes But yeah, um, that winter rose base just wasn't doing it for me. So I had to just use that blank canvas. And then it took me a little minute over here because I think I said it before, I have a stigma. So it's like so hard for me to do makeup on this eye because I can't see. I'm blind. I don't know, hopefully I just wasn't talking a little bit too much and then y'all like, girl, what are we talking about? But no, it, I was just talking because it's just like certain things that people be saying on TikTok and y'all already know like when people go viral on TikTok, people just be following everything people be saying. It's just like, child, please, like, like when it comes to like relationships and like just living life and people just always just be following what somebody else saying like you barely even know what that person got going on and you taking their advice like, i mean i'm not saying it's bad to take people's advice but what i'm saying is like don't always just be like i don't know let me shut up i just basically go off of what i say more so than what somebody else say now people just be all over the place like people say one thing one minute and then they switch up the next like child please mm -mm. that's all we doing over here yeah and i went a little bigger because i want the um look to be to be big and exaggerated but anywho um I'm taking this pink glitter that I got from my local beauty supply store and it looks like that. And you don't want to go all the way down because wait, why don't you want to go all the way down, Kayla? Um Yeah, you don't want to go all the way down with your glitter because I'm gonna be adding a liner um if you want to. If you wanna add a liner, but don't go all the way down because um it's going to be hard adding a liner over top of your glitter that's why yeah this glitter goes perfectly with the pink but i'm gonna just keep going and i'm gonna shut up I'll be back y'all, I need my rhinestones. I left them in the bathroom. Went to go get my stones, came back with the soda. But um, I looked in the bathroom, in the bathroom mirror, and then it's just like every time, every, no, but I don't know if y'all know this, but like every time like you feeling like you look good or something, um, like, yeah, you look good in a room, but as soon as you step into the bathroom, something else happens. Like as soon as you go into the bathroom, it's like, I look 10 times more better. Like, come on. Yeah, we gonna be, we, we, we just gonna be, and we going extra. So, I'm gonna take these big old rhinestones, and I'm gonna just put them around. Um, this, I don't even know, like, why I'm going so big today. But um, with me saying like everything, it's, it's not like I'm trying to bash. I'm just saying like, follow, more so like follow the beat of your own damn drum. And you know, like everybody, <laughs> yeah, I'm so tough. I'm so this, I don't, I-D-G, what, I don't get me down. Yeah, G-I-D-G-A-F type of person. But it's just like, relax, okay? relax. You do not have to be like that all the time. In my personal opinion, you don't have to be like that all the time. I feel like this is way too big. Yeah, I feel like that one's too, just a little too big, so I'm gonna go with this one. I'm just going to 
going to add that liner. I don't think I'm going to show y'all the liner part because like I have so many videos of me showing liner. So I think I'll just, I'll just be back. Alright y'all, so I am done. It is very extra. Very, very extra. Um, I did my eyeliner the same way that I always do. So it's really nothing different when it comes to that. And I don't know. I don't know if I like it yet because I'm not really like an extra on mine. I don't know. I really don't know. I feel like it's, it's just something about it that I'm not feeling just yet. Maybe because my makeup not fully really done yet. And that's what tends to happen like all the time. I think I'm going to use these lashes. Um, these these lashes right here, um, they are from my um, my cosmetics line. But like I said in my previous video, um, I'm not selling anything right now. But I will be back to selling them. I mean, yeah, selling cosmetics again. Um, I'm just going to try to like rebrand everything and just do things better. You know, like the packaging and stuff like that. So yeah. Talking in the group chat. I don't ever respond to the group chat because I just be chilling. I be doing my own thing. <laughs> and if people really be thinking like I'm not the quiet one, the quiet one of the group, like the family group, I really be done. Just be doing shit for real, for real. I be chilling. And then I hate, I hate that too. Like people be thinking like, oh. We you rude because you ain't saying nothing first of all for one i did say something you just didn't hear me i said hi how you doing you didn't hear me when i entered the room so relax um i already have a soft voice and then on top of that i just i'm shy too so i hate when people be like oh that was rude no you just didn't hear me relax so yeah <laughs> even though for real that's like one of my pet peeves Oh, she rude. She ain't say nothing. Uh, yes, I do. You just didn't hear me because I'm shy and I don't talk like that to people I don't know. So, I wasn't being rude. You just didn't hear me. Thank you. And I actually think it was the lashes. I was missing the lashes. That looks 10 times better. Yeah. <laughs> Alright y'all, so I'm just um using my finger <laughs> to blend in my concealer because um I lost my brush for my concealer. I don't know where it's at. I actually need to go ahead and wash my brushes. But um it's actually not bad to use your finger. I remember well on like I mean you can use it on clients, your fingers and make sure they're clean. But I was watching um Danessa Myricks. And she was like, sometimes your fingers are your best tool. So you can go ahead and use your fingers. But I already primed. I used the milk um, primer as always. And I use the same products. But I'm not going to show you my foundation routine. Because I use the same products all the time. But like I said, um, I actually feel like coming together <laughs> like at first i was like mm, i'm not sure if i like it but now i actually really really like it so and yeah like i said i'm sorry if i talked like way too much like in this video but yes very very extra <laughs> if you don't like extra i don't think this is the video for you Are you all these back? Oh, my son done sit on my face. Oh, early I was like, oh, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. Like, girl, yes, you do know. Have some faith in yourself. Come on. Look at it. Come on. I've literally been using, like, all three. Well, not all three. Sometimes here and there. But now, mm -hmm. Yeah, today i'm not gonna go so much with the pink only because i did like pink eyeshadow but i literally been loving the beauty bakery um 
blush yeah the little blushes the smackerings and this one right here i feel like it's like my favorite because it, it's like this little burnt orange and it just yeah i just love it see and then this one's a little bit orange and i just i look a little bit pink i probably just did a little bit too much but it's okay because i'm gonna take my um my mac Um, powder foundation so that's pretty much it like all I do and then I just kept trying to use the um the morphe banana rich um setting powder but I just I don't think I'm going to keep using that because I really love the Laura Mercier setting powder. Um, I don't know why it took me so long to use it, but I absolutely love it. Like I'm not going back. Like I don't think I'm going to switch to another uh, setting powder ever again. And. I had an I was using a different um contour brush for my nose, but this Morphe E62. Yes. Yeah, I don't know why I even um dusted away my setting powder, but like I said, I'm gonna be adding pink at the bottom of my eye. And I think I'm just gonna do like just straight pink. I don't, I don't think I wanna like darken it up. So I'm just going for that like hot pink color that's in um the instinct palette. So yes, I used one palette today. Yay! And then I'm just gonna take um the Sephora for precision liner, the same liner that I used um in my waterline. I actually like the um, liquid liner in my waterline more than um, using like a pencil. See, that just poured everything together. And I just gotta go get my lip gloss that's in the bathroom. So yes, we're doing like a lip gloss, not a lipstick, but a lip gloss. It's already extra. And I feel like a bright star. So we're just gonna make it a little bit more extra. One second. Okay. Alright, yeah, so I said this before in my previous video that um this elf pink cosmo lip gloss is is one of the lip glosses that I'm using right now. This is my favorite lip combo. Um, also, one second. Yeah, if you don't have like all of this, you can go ahead and use, no, 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 no. I'm sorry. The dupe is actually for the, um, the Elf Pink Cosmo lip gloss. So if your Target, whatever, don't have it, you can go to Morphe and get um, Boho. And it show up just like it too. So yeah. But first I love the um the kiss lip liner. So I'm just gonna put that on first. And I know sometimes people like overline their lips or whatever, but I don't, I don't, I don't do that. <laughs> so, um, yeah, I, I just, I don't. Um, I feel like my lips is kind of full, like I don't really need to do all that. No, sh no shade, no shade, you should be like, oh my gosh, but relax. But no, um, I just do it, do it regularly. And then I'll take the Jade and look um cosmetics um i'll list everything below i always say that but sometimes i don't list things in the in the box below so that's my fault because i always forget it 
um, attention, attention lip gloss. And I feel like this look right here is like the, you know, the black girl lip. I feel like people started to get it from SZA a lot. Well, that's the first time I've seen it and then I've seen somebody else do it. Well, not saying that. It's, I mean, it's like a popular lip combo, like the look. But I'm not saying like SZA or whoever did it first. But to me, it's like the, you know, the regular black girl look. And then from Cosmo, just pour everything in together. And then that's it, I'll just take the elf. And then that's it. Alright y'all, so that's pretty much it with this video. I really hope y'all like, like it. Um, I really like doing these videos for like myself and also for y'all because yeah i mean it's just really, really cute and it's fun just to sit down and chill out and just like make myself look cute and feel good and just have fun um i really really like doing this so please if you watch this video make sure you like comment and subscribe and i will see y'all in the next one bye y'all oh child no, I'm not trying to leave off. I didn't even do the highlighter. <laughs> what the? <laughs> didn't even do the highlight. Bomb this room. Must tell me I'm poor. And I get it from my mammy bomb, man. Bust down these house, can